Okay, so we're going to be sharpening this uh, fillet knife. Um, we've got about a 20 degree angle set on this right now. And let's take a look at that. So we can make sure. And we can afford to have a little bit steeper of an angle on this because it is going to be one of those knives that's going to get constant maintenance and constant touch up. The biggest thing you want to watch is the deflection that you're going to get at the end here. You can see this as you put pressure on it, it's going to move. So you really need to just have a light, nice touch to it in order to get this to work out properly. Almost need to hold it. It's just so thin and flexible. This may be one of those that we may have to move it into just to get that tip properly. Okay, starting to move. Arkansas stone is next. Ultra, ultra sharpness and ultra edge ma maintenance is really required on these fillet knives to really for them to really operate properly. Um, you just gotta I sharpen it pretty much every time we use it, and that way it is always in tip top shape, ready to go. So we can see we're starting to get a very, very nice edge on that. And take this. These India stones. Just a good rub down with this.
knife right there. So now I'm going to back the knife out since this one is so long and flexible. And we concentrate on the tip of the knife here. Come back to the beginning with these two. Saw a stone after that. Get these back on here. Stones back on. I'll finish it up. Oops. Okay, so let's check this thing out and see what we got here. You can see our double bevel and our nice polish directly under there. You can see how that just really shows up nice and pretty on there. And you can see the secondary edge. That's going to give it the toughness that it needs. To maintain that edge while you're cutting through bones and, and fish and you know whatever else this thing's going to go through but it's it's also going to be easily sharpened the next time we go to sharpen this thing and this thing is just razor razor sharp i mean sharp sharp and thing is just barely anything for that for cutting anything there so that's how to get your fillet knife just as sharp as you possibly can. Better than factory new right there. So for more information, uh, click the subscribe button below and want more sharpening tips and tricks.